Okay, so I've just um, sort of getting back to me sixty eight thousand um, sort of learning curve if you like. I set this um, sort of emulated software environment up with uh, Hitori. That's what that was. Um, probably about six months sort of into last year, maybe it's August. Um, probably July ish last year. Um, set up some sort of six eight thousand resources but you know you kinda get backtracked and sidetracked. Obviously this is just a a sort of um just sideline type of stuff like but um it's nice to sort of get back to it. Um it's me sort of Windows XP beast if you like. Um quite a nice system for the for the era like um, I got it off eBay in sort of 2020 I think um, and I was buying some cool stuff off eBay and everybody was short of money and they were sort of putting putting computers and stuff like that which was appealing to me on eBay as they were emptying the lofts so I obviously took advantage of that and bagged myself an um, XP dual screen um, and obviously the chap who I bought off was very kind um, he accepted me sort of quite cheeky and sort of low offer for what it was. Um, it's quite an expensive sort of motherboard and the case is actually bigger than the Mac Pro 3 one and that sort of said something if you know the size of those things. Um, but I so I sort of found a space in the corner of me living room to set this up. Um, so I've sort of found some old music back in the days when we used to um, sort of use MP3s on, store them on like hard disks, you know. So I found some sort of old music which is providing the audio entertainment. I've got the headphones in, obviously, you see a card, so I hear them from the sort of recording light. Um, have a look. So, Hitori, uh, that's an image from Hitori Falcon. Um, it's on here, there it is. Um, Hitori, I've sort of provided it here. Um, so, I, um, this is your yeah, Hitori running under Windows XP. Obviously, you can use 7, or I'm not sure if it runs on 10, probably will, or 11. Um, it's a bit too new for me these days. It's bloody awful that I hear that um Emutus, it's bloody awful. Um okay, so this is it's obviously on my desktop up to the um Tory Fountain up to the um, it's in there somewhere. So the most balanced system I found emulated um you know I don't need an O four I don't need an O six O for dev pack. 3.0 in high res. Um, Hitori Falcon, um, an off memory. Probably need to put the RAM up a bit more, I don't think. Oh, it's 4 megabytes RAM, it's an 030, 32 megahertz. I think that's tweaked. Um, and I think off the top of my head, don't quote us on this, TOS 4.04 is the experimental. No, it's not 4, 492, I think it's the last version but it wasn't officially released because it was like a sort of experimental type of um, thing that wasn't released. So 4.04 gives us the most stablest, slickest, sort of high res um, development environment for DevPack 3. I remember tweaking all this six months ago. Um, so it's already saved me hard disk and all that jazz. Obviously I haven't got anything on it because all I wanted was um, sort of Dev Pack 3, but that's all set up and ready to run. Um, I think 
it was all installed on the hard disk from the disk image and all that jazz so that's all sort of ready um, so come out of that um, and I got some tutorials as well ready um, 68k tutorials um, and I put them all in the folders because obviously it's running an older version of a browser and you know it wasn't really loading up the HTML but I just want them for my own reference so I could um, it was the best site that I found for 68k tutorials but I just I don't really need to go on the internet on this one because it's for development purposes um, 68k assembly stuff and emulation and stuff it's an old machine so it's but I've got all my um, resources I did touch on 68,000 68, assembler years and years ago but I just again I got sidetracked my business and stuff and so I thought I'd have a night at least getting back into it I think I trying to think where I ran through to um, sort of foundational stuff you know addressing memory probably about addressing memory or something, a graphics memory. I think I got that sort of far, so I'm going to sort of continue in with that. Um, but again, I mean, that's quite a, a nice system to use. Um, it's enjoyable. It's quite a fast system for the Windows XP era stuff and probably one of the fastest sort of systems of that era that you get. It was quite an expensive system, but it's the um, desktop. So back to Neo 3 also. Let's reset that one. So that's one sort of spend with the well the afternoon. At least a few cogs in the morning as it is. You know, we don't sit all day on playing about with computers. We do have other things to do as well. But I freed some time up so that I could have a bit of play about with this on my Sunday. Um, so there you go, that's my 68000 um, dev pack for the emulated sort of environment. And I don't actually think that I'll be able to get a slicker system. So that's all ready for me to start um, progressing with that. Okay, folks, cheers, have a good Sunday.